I am in Logan, Ohio, outside of the Hocking Hills Regional Visitor Center. This is uh, the home of Hocking Hills State Park, and uh, they actually have a roadside attraction here. It is the Paul A. Johnson Pencil Sharpener Museum. Paul A. Johnson collected pencil sharpeners, and he put his collection in the shed at his home in a nearby town, and when he died in 2010, uh, the shed and the collection got moved here for a permanent display. All right, this is the museum. It's a one-room shed, but with a lot of pencil sharpeners, and all of them are totally unique from each other. When a lot of these guys die, their attractions and museums disappear. But uh, luckily, uh, the people here in Logan appreciated him and his collection, so uh, it's here to stay. There are over 3,400 pencil sharpeners that Reverend Johnson collected over 20 years in this little shed. So we're gonna take a very in-depth look at the variety of pencil sharpeners that for some reason exist in the world. I don't know much about the history of pencil sharpeners or the models. There's a lot of unexpected ones, old and new.
was neat. Now we're gonna go into the park. All right, I am now at the Camwell Cliffs unit of Hocking Hill State Park. This is a separate area. It's a little north of Logan, and uh, most people do not come to see this part, but it's supposed to be a really cool trail, so uh, that's what I'm gonna do now. This looks like a pretty old log structure for picnics. Might have been built by the Civilian Conservation Corps in the 30s.
This is like a fat man squeeze area, like it. Rock City. But anyways, if you like this video, uh, check out my other videos at Hawking Hill State Park and at Roadside Attractions and Weird Museums. So uh, go check those out, and thanks for watching.